there's many different ways of tying your belt. And what we have to ensure is that we don't have it crossed at the back. So there's a lot of people that favor um, crossing it over equal amount of belt here and crossing it over here. But of course, if you just go directly around the back here, um, then it cross, and many people have it crossed. Um, but what you've got to do is make sure that you have it well tucked in so that when it comes back round the front here, uh, that you're ready to tie your belt and you've got no cross at the back. My particular way um, that uh, I like to tie my belt is by having um, a big loose bit on the floor first of all right so I've just got a short bit here and what I do is I wrap uh, the belt all the way around my back then back round again here and as you can see all right from the back there, it was completely flat. And from the front here, I've got to ensure that I have equal amounts of belt. But also, I need it so that it's not too baggy in here and not too tight as well. Um, I always then teach uh, the, for people, youngsters or grown-ups to go underneath both here. So now I've got one that's gone right the way. The one that was on top goes right the way underneath both here. And then the normal knot is over the top and through the gap here to have the knot. All right, now we have the knot here and we have equal amounts of belt here as well. And you can check to see if it fits snugly. You don't want it too tight, you don't want it too loose, all right? And what we don't want is a windmill belt. We don't want that. Uh, the other popular way now, once we've got this far, all right, and we'll untie it again, all right? So this one goes over the top once we've actually done the whole twirl, all right? And I'll take it off quickly and we'll just do it again, all right? So we have... This bit here fairly short. This one goes all the way round, all the way round here, flat at the back, and this one is over the top and underneath both here. All right, and the competition way of tying the belt now is to just separate the two belts here and take this one down in between this one over the top and you're going to go here in between and you're going to pull it tight and again we need to have equal amounts of belt there and it needs to be snug and it needs to be comfortable that knot there needs to be pulled tight and now you're ready for action